we need to <coughs> plummet. Is there anything else they do? We'll need to do plumbing. Ha yeah, well, some of them are like some of the assault maps are like 15 objectives. It's uh, it can be quite daunting. Uh, uh, Island Strike specifically is is uh, got that problem. Actually, I believe actually not Island Strike, but Tropical has that problem. Red team is attacking. That is Team Nice. Blue team is defending. That is Team Dan. Both of these teams need a win. Uh, I need to pull up the standings very quickly while we oversee this. So Team Nice, uh, they fell 1-2 to Team X and then beat Team Cold 2-0. So that gives them four points currently. Remember, top four make playoffs, and the playoff positions are currently occupied with teams on six points. So if you win 2-0, you get three points. If you win 2-1, you get two points. If you lose 1-2, you get one point. Attackers are making good progress to get towards this objective, but they haven't been able to get on the objective. That's what they have to do. <coughs> and they've been stopped by these power cores. So that's a great shock core combo that's taken out man there. And uh, the problem is uh, he's isolated over there. He will certainly die, and the attackers will have to come again. Defenders pushing them back further now. <coughs> so it's Forciet, Bonyan, Forgotten, and Dan on the Team Dan side. On the Team Nicer side, it's Tom Sawyer, Nicer, Natsu, and Wise. So, uh, they're trying to take the long way round. That shield gun might help. It's, it's start, they've started the progress bar. But Wise has kind of been found out here on the side, and he's got three to try and find. That's a really good shot combo that takes out two of them, but he will fall. The objective is halfway gone now. <clears throat> One more here on the side, just trying to rush in there with a the shield gun. You can see they got the shield gun on the try and deflect these projectiles, but they are unable to get anywhere closer towards this objective. There's one on it now, I believe. There is. Can he's just been killed before that bar is depleted. And uh, attackers have been stopped, so they have to come again here. <clears throat> but good progress so far. On that bar, it's a good shot core. One for one there, though. Nicer's taken out. They got two on the far side trying to uh, approach. One's taken down here, and then the other one on the far side is killed as well. So uh, they have to reset. Remember, if you die, there is a seven-second reinforcement timer, which if that timer is ticking down, you cannot respawn in until it hits zero. Uh, it's kind of blocked by the HUD, but it is up on the, uh, up on the top left, uh, blocked by Tom Sawyer's health. Uh, stats, but uh, Wise trying to get close, but he's taken down. They've got one here as well. Just needs to get on the objective, and Nice does complete that objective. Walls have been breached. That's the optional one there. They have to destroy this barricade over here as well. That'll progress them. There is a minigun there to try and stop them. <clears throat> and coming through the far doors, you can see one on the far side here. Could go for the objective right away, and not the optional one, but he is taken down. The minigun's been destroyed <coughs> with enough damage, but they're, they're having trouble getting through these doorways here. Unable to get through. Oh, sneaking through. Maybe sneaking through. Yeah, sneaking through. Going for the objective is why is um, Nice himself, the captain of Team Nice. Shock horse coming in by Forgotten, trying to take him off this objective. But he's done about half the health. He is taken down, but he's done very well to get half that bar, half that health bar on the objective completed. They haven't been able to take this optional objective. They've been very much held off, but the, the actual mandatory one has been dealt quite a good amount of damage. Nicer's gotten to the back lines again. <clears throat> come, they've come around the corner here to try and compete or, or try and eliminate him. They have done so, but... He's again damaged it further. Shield gun dodge. And Natsu is going to help damage that even further. The idea behind this might be to get the mandatory objective, push the attacker spawn back inside that base. And then that might make this optional objective easier for them to take. In fact, that optional objective has been started by Weiss. Natsu is here as well. They all will fall, but they do about a fifth of the damage towards that bar. Meanwhile... In the backside again. Nice. Gets the kill. Can he get the objective? No. He falls right before. His teammate will fall as well. 
but certainly they are very close to completing this objective. There's Weiss, he destroys the objective, he will fall, but attack, the defenders now will spawn inside the base. They will not spawn up he top here. They will spawn down inside. They can go inside, they're holding the objective. Tom Sawyer gets the optional one. So they have more forward weapons, and now it's about this Sentinel gun here that must be destroyed. This is the third objective. This is a very difficult objective. You can see it's a pretty bad choke point here for the attackers <coughs> that they're being fed into. Good rockets blast, but it's not done any damage. And that Sentinel is activated. It's done a bit. They can heal it with the link gun as well, the defenders, which you might see come out shortly. Pretty good flat cannonball. <coughs> there's the there's the the link gun trying to get it repaired. Rockets missed. Oh, he's missed he's missed three rockets, Natsu. That's far from ideal. He's missed three rockets over the top. And that sentinel remains, and it will be repaired even further. Triple rocket just whizzes by. There's a good triple rocket hit, but it's not enough to take it down. Double rockets fly by. And there it is. The Sentinel's gone. We're into the fourth objective of this match, which is going to be a secondary Sentinel here. Eight minute 21 remaining in this round. Wise warming up. Wise is warming up. <clears throat> He's got a... Oh, they've got the link guns hooked up as well. Remember, the link gun, you can, you can use your link gun on a teammate and it will make their link gun more powerful so when you see those, those those green bars on the link gun like the or these shots when you see them turn yellow or white that's how you know they're linked up and that's a more powerful attack coming in still the sentinel here down to about third hp again it can be repaired they're not going for it and attackers oh man they're being stopped right at the front here a little bit of damage going out. They're not able to find it. Oh, he's just snuck in around the side. Sentinel probably should be destroyed. He dies with very little health left on the Sentinel. Can they repair it is the question. One good rocket will be enough to take that out of the equation and move them onto the missile silo. Sentinel's activated, Sentinel and he's just got it. Sentinel's destroyed. <clears throat> We're over to the... Missile silo now. A very large missile. And they want to plant C4s on the explosives. Or they want to plant C4 explosives on the missile here. Defenders being fired at, you can see. One's come from up above, immediately taken down by that shock core. Another one eliminated. So they, they can come from any one number of directions, the attackers. They have options to come from here. They have options to come from down there. They have options to come from over here as well, where 4 it's currently is. Good shot, core. That should get them in towards the missile silo. Good shield gun kill as well. Can he get on the objective is the question. Oh, three really good rockets right at the feet. They've got two here. He just needs to hold. And... Uh, from both sides. Shield gun can only block bullets from a certain direction right in front of you. And uh, he was double teamed there. Not gonna prevent any progress towards the missile silo. They need to get in here towards the missile silo. Going underneath here. Where they're gonna hold. They're holding the one on the front. They've got one of the C4s down. <coughs> that bar you can see is about halfway. He's died. The one on the back side's being taken as well. <clears throat> They've got three on the back. They're looking to take, they're looking to finish the progress here. Shield gun is up, but not much made. Now in the front, can they complete the front objective? They're going for the back one, it looks like. They've got five of the C4, all six are on the back. That objective's complete. They have to get this one on the front now. Oh, look at this. The attackers have gone too far forward. He's missed the jump. That is unfortunate. That might cause nice. And that has. He's not made much progress because he missed the jump onto the missile silo. Bonian's got a killing spree here, which is good for the defense. Four minute 49 remaining. Still three objectives in play. 
<clears throat> there they are. They're going to get on it. They just need to step on it a little bit more. There it is. Weiss completes it. Door will open up. And now they have to destroy these two aircraft guns. Four minute, 31 remaining. It's the team that completes the objectives quicker. If it goes to 15 minutes on the first round, then it's about the number of objectives that need to be completed. Finding an angle and a half is uh, one of the attackers. He's done a lot of damage to that gun, actually. There is some angles you can find with the lightning gun. <clears throat> Just jumping down here. Literally, maybe a bullet left for that air aircraft gun. <clears throat> there is also an angle right on the edge of that platform. You're going to see it there. Oh, he's missed the jump. You could stand on the edge of that platform and lightning gun the very tip of this anti-aircraft gun. Uh, but he's trying to fall down. He's trying to fall down onto that ledge there because you won't die if you do that. Oh, he's missed the ledge and he's missed the gun. This is a comedy of errors. An absolute comedy of errors here. <coughs> They've just got to find this this little HP that the gun has for the first objective of the two. Over the edge he goes. There he is. That's the angle we were talking about with the lightning gun. He's starting to do the damage. He's, di he's died on the left. Can oh, they get it? Yes. Destroyed. Natsu gets that flat cannon. Long range. Not a long range weapon, but he does get it working long range. And that's enough to take that weapon down. It's all about this one now. Dan's killing spree is over. Trying to find the angle. You can see there he is with the lightning gun. Using that angle. We talked about. Doing a ton of damage. Can he get the gun down? They're onto him now. They're going to try and get up here to get the kill. They need to. And there's three rockets to the face. To end it. Now trying to just find... They were trying to use that as a distraction to get further down the ramp. Maybe just get this gun, gun down. He's missed that lightning shock. Oh, he's he's missed that lightning bolt. The lightning gun shot. And uh, that's cost him. Does he get this? Objective Does he get it down? Destroyed. Yes. They're on the final power objective. The power core has been Energy picked up. Been they need to bring it to the two vehicle. They have two remain. minutes to do so. Power core dropped. <clears throat> This could be very difficult. Power Dan's on another out. killing spree. And he's dropped the power core. Power core right there. Good rocket. They need power to pick it up. up. Weiss has power picked it up. He's draw. immediately shot out of the air. That power core has not made much progress. Power if it's not up. touched within, I believe, 20 seconds, it power will reset. <coughs> picked up. Nice has got it. They've got to deliver it. He's dropped it. And, oh, it's only moved another inch. They've got to get these kills. Natsu falls. It's a 1v4 over here. That power core is certainly going to reset now. Two. Certainly the power core is going to reset. And indeed it is. They've not been up. able to get the kills, though. That's the problem. They have to get these kills. Power, core Power drop. cores dropped by Natsu. Should Power be picked up picked here. Up. It will be. That rocket's going to do a good amount of damage. Oh, drop. another rocket right at the foot. And they all Power die. Core Power core has been picked up. A lot of damage going down Power onto core Wise. Power core Natsu's picked, picked it up. Can he Power deliver it? Drop. Oh, it's dropped just a meter away. From the final destination, if they can get this kill and they don't, then they could have definitely delivered 20 it. Seconds. 20 seconds. That power core is probably going to reset. They have to just absolutely all out attack. But Ten, they all die. Nine. Power core reset. The power core has been power reset. We will up. go to time. So, Four, all but the final three, objective for Team two. Wise. One. Blue team successfully defended. <coughs> As New Team Dan defends. Four, three, two, one. Now here we go on to the offense for Team Dan. Second round here. 
There is a green timer also hidden by the HUD, unfortunately. It's just a way of modern Unreal Tournament 2004. But um, that green timer that you see hidden by Natsu and Wise's health in the top left, that is the pace timer. I will let you know how much pace or, or how quickly these objectives are being completed versus the pace of the opening round. Coming in is Bonyan. Can he get these, this kill? He's using the shield gun. He's trying to shield himself in there. He's died, but they have started the progress at least. Two minute 30 ahead of the pace now is Team Dan. Nicer takes some fall damage. That ends his killing spree. <clears throat> they got three on the far side here trying to complete this objective. Bonyan's trying to just absolutely beeline for it, and he's taken down. Four, <laughs> four C it does very well. It gets some more progress on the timer or on the hold objective there. Dan trying to get in there himself, but he's been blown out of out of it by the shock combo. It can push you around quite a bit. That's a good kill from Forsyth. He's got the shield gun up. Can he get it? He dies with barely anything left on the timer, but they're making good progress, Team Dan. They can get this objective well ahead of the pace. Bonyan shot out of the air. <clears throat> and so not quite complete just yet. Minute 35 ahead of the pace. They've got to get in there and just get that last little bit of progress on that bar. Dan's going to get in there. Dan's going to complete the objective. Gates, destroyed. Gates are going to blow open. And we're into the second, the second field here, including this barricade objective. The optional one is there for the forward cache. They're starting to shoot the minigun because they don't even want it to come into play early. They're just going to take that out early, remove that from the defender's arsenal. <clears throat> Two minute 57 ahead of the pace. 12.37 left in the round. Team Dan have bought themselves the entire 15-minute allotment here to complete this, the, this round. Remember, if, a, if the opening team completes the objectives in less than 15 minutes, that's then the time they completed it is the only time you get to do the same. Team Nice having failed to means Team Dan gets the full 15 minute round. Eleven fifty-seven. They're actually f struggling to get through this, um, this, this, these doorways here. Remember, it was Team Nice that did very well to to move into the back lines here and um, destroy this barricade. That is going to be a little bit of damage going down on the barricade. Forsyth's doing some work here. He's going to get it about a third of the way. And meanwhile, that's run as a distraction to get the forward outpost. They've done very well. It means they can spawn a lot further up. They've done, uh, they've done good damage to the barricade as well. It's almost halfway dead. <clears throat> Having trouble getting around that corner, though. Here's um, Force gets doing. Here come the rockets, man! Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> team two. Oh, you think uh, Team Nicer's gonna win? I don't know. This barricade's gonna go down a minute seven ahead of the pace. Two minute fifteen now. Dan is ahead of the pace. <clears throat> it is. Uh, It's Team Dan on the offensive. And they're just coming in here. Sentinel's been activated. That's a big miss rocket. Two good ones, though, land. Really good early damage down on the rocket. They're going to repair it as best as they can. Try and get this health back up. Oh, there come the rockets again. It's a barrage of them. They've got another two. That's the Sentinel down. Two minute 47 ahead of the pace, this team, Dan. And now we're on to the secondary Sentinel. 
Borsi, it's already doing the damage. Tons of damage get coming pouring into Sentinel early on. Trying to repair it, but that is just that is just uh, feeble. And now Team Dan are four minute twenty one ahead of the pace with three objectives to go. They've got to arm the silo with the C four explosives. They've got to destroy the anti aircraft turrets and then take the power core and escape with the ship. Might be going for the back objective here. Indeed, forgotten already on there. The rockets come out to do some damage, but T Dan himself has done the forward objective almost in its entirety. Three minute 47 the pace now. Here comes Forgotten. He wants that back objective, Forgotten. He might get it. Oh, that's a really good shot core. That's going to give him some time. The front this objective's complete. Is the back head. objective's complete. And now Team Dan have given themselves 5 minute 50 ahead of the pace to take out these anti-aircraft guns. Two objectives remain for Team Dan. <clears throat> and they have 8 minute 40 with which to complete them. Trying to get into a position to get these anti-aircraft guns down. <clears throat> They're wiped out. They'll have to reinforce themselves here. Going for the uh, Dan. Going for it. I don't know what Dan's going for. Actually, I would have thought they would have held that angle. Dan's using a flat cannon long range. He's done a little bit of damage. He will die. And now the link gun coming out on the far side. They've started to really chip away. They've got almost half of the left side turret here gone. They're in a really good position. Rockets come in flying in. It's missed. There's one that's hit. There's two that's hit. They will die, but that is. They're using that angle we talked about. And this turret on the left is almost gone. There's one down. Five minute 31 ahead of the pace. Seven minute 35 to complete the last two objectives, including this anti-aircraft gun, which the lightning gun is in position yet again. Well, he's just jumped over the edge. But this anti-aircraft gun almost half HP. <clears throat> they want to get these kills on the forward players. Push the defense back. Not being able to get much progress here in these last two reinforcement rounds. Now the lightning gun comes out. There you go. Two good shots. Let's put the HP of the turret down below half. And the question is, can they complete these objectives? Four minute 39 ahead of the pace. This one's taken Team Dan probably the longest amount of time. They've looked very good. Flax coming in, long range, rocket. There it is. They've got six oh, minute 31 Energy has to get acquired. this to the vehicle I believe they 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 would have already won this game given that they've completed the uh turrets in a quicker fashion and that that might do it actually that might be it and yes the power core has been taken by forgotten to the ship Dan's going to win the map with 613 to spare forgotten the hero and they've won the opening map team Dan 1-0 over Team Nice. We have to think about what the second map will be, which is going to be, by the way, Team Dan's map pick. So Team Dan, their previous map pick uh, when they played Team YK was Sabrosa. Uh, so that's definitely a possibility. Team Dan played Team YK um, on this stream last weekend. And they actually swap Sabrosa's. Uh, YK picked Sabrosa Nightmare version, and Dan picked Sabrosa Original version. So you have to think Sabrosa could be on the cards here. We'll see where we're at and where we're going to. We are going to. Uh, I don't know if this was the map pick. Um, I'm going to run the. <laughs> is that say? Bloody lovely. Love nice. We're going to go to a quick break. I'm going to run the ads so they don't interrupt this game when we get underway we'll be back in about 90 seconds time don't go anywhere
right. Welcome back, everybody. Robot Factory is the pick. The classic Unreal Tournament map from the vanilla version of the game. Attackers will spawn down there where there are tanks in the far distance. Um, you could just see them with the green bars above them. They will have to deal with these two turrets. That's going to absolutely have a go at them. But they will have a hold objective over here. Uh, they have a third turret here, by the way, that will shoot at them. So that could be problematic for the attackers but they will have a hold objective here the turrets can be controlled with this panel right here after that there is another turret on the opposite side and there is a big gun sitting on that platform that raised platform over there by the way they have another two uh plasma turrets they're gonna have to deal with here um but the plasma turrets are not mandatory objectives they're not objectives at all but they do they do hurt quite a bit but they will have to destroy this ion cannon uh, as their secondary objective, after which um, they will have to destroy. I, I don't even think the iron cannon is a mandatory objective itself. It's just the big cannon that hurts. Um, they will have to destroy this blast door, though. And once they do so, uh, the, well, I can't show you because the game doesn't load the textures until the objective's complete. So that's Unreal Tournament was optimized in that way. So if I go down here, you just it's a whole bunch of nothing. Uh, <laughs> So that's how they optimized it. But they will have to go into the factory. Um, there is uh, an AI generator in the factory they will have to destroy, as well as three shield generators that are mandatory objectives. Um, and once they complete that, they will be able to, uh, or that'll be the end of the offense. So um, everybody's in the server. <coughs> We're almost ready to get underway here. I don't know what the delay is, but um, we should be getting away. We should be getting underway very shortly with what should be our second map of this best of three. Team Dan wins it. They will win this series by a score of two maps to nil. If Team Nice wins this, we will go to a decider, which they will veto the maps for the decider. A reminder: the map pool, by the way. <clears throat> for Division 2, Fallen City, Robot Factory, Glacier, Convoy, Junkyard, Mothership. So those are the six vanilla assault maps from the original version of Unreal Tournament 2004. Sabrosa Nightmare Edition, Sabrosa Original Edition, Industrial, Insurrection, Island Strength, which comes from the Unreal Community Map Pack, or UCMP. Overgrown and Xenon as well as the uh, as the map. So much different to the Division One map, which we will map pool, which we will see later on today. <coughs> I'm trying to repair the link gun, the turret. They've done very oh, they've repaired it with the other turret. But that should do it there. That turret's down. 2K Wise manning this one here. <coughs> and they've got they've he got a double destroyed. link gun on it to try and uh, keep it up. Destroyed. They've got another link gun in the back automatically firing at them. This these this link gun could be problematic here for them. They've got to get a link, like a link up of three or four players and and pour that, that ammo like you saw down on this gun. <coughs> 4v4. Oh, he did not last long. Double double tank coming down here now. Vehicle destroyed. Vehicle destroyed. Oh, that's not good. He's going to die as well. No progress whatsoever being made by Team Dan early on. The tank's not doing anything. They're trying to run distraction for the Vehicle tank so they destroyed. can destroy this turret. But the the reload time on the tank shells are so long.
you can see when that turret turns. When that turret turns, it doesn't it's it doesn't have the angle anymore. They don't have the angle on the offense. So this has become very, very difficult for this offense. They need to almost go on the far Vehicle side here. Destroyed. Three to four of them. Link up and then shoot over. Vehicle destroyed. Because they can repair this this gun. They can repair it. can see if he if he oh they've just got the angle but the repair they can't fight against the repair vehicle destroyed and that the, the this link up this double link up is doing so much damage to the tanks <coughs> double tank on the way they would have had the forward intel that from the, the player over there. Destroyed. Just Vehicle instantly. Destroyed. They've run distraction, though, for this link gun over here. They finally get it down. That's that's big. But they've wasted three minutes doing so. They can move forward now. They've got another link gun here. But this one they might be able to get the angle on a little bit better. Taking a tank shell or two. And they're trying to repair it on the back lines. There we go. Destroyed. They've got to pour the damage on these guys. They have to continue to pour the damage on. There they go. That, 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 that turret's down. They got one more in the back line here that's going to be in play when they go to hold this objective. <coughs> So we'll see how they do. The tank's obviously not going to be able to fit there. Oh, it's a good hold. It's a good hold there. They did. They got about half of that opening hold done. Vehicle destroyed. Satellite and there it is. Aligned. They've got that forward uh, satellite dish. So the tanks and whatnot are going to spawn right in front of that gun. Players are going to spawn up there. They've, they've eliminated that one gun on the side. That's nicely done. <clears throat> that red beam is the ion cannon. You can see it's going to do a ton of damage. They've got that turret down. They've got one more to deal with here on the left-hand side, and then they've got the ion cannon itself, which is going to do a ton of damage. Vehicle destroyed. <laughs> Absolutely eliminates and wipes out that tank. You cannot, they cannot repair the ion cannon, I don't think. And that is about a tank shell away. Yep, ion it's gone. Ion cannon destroyed. Ion cannon is destroyed. Now they've got the one turret over here they have to deal with. That's going to do that some, them some damage, and they need to move. They've, they've missed five minutes just trying to get through the outskirts of the robot yeah, factory. That, that is <clears throat> particularly problematic. Vehicle destroyed. Oh, that's very nice. Just blow it up. You don't need all five. Just blow it up. All the turrets on the outside are now down. They're going to have to hold on to it the good old-fashioned way. That's on their foot, and they've got to do it against tanks. Nine minute ten, though, is what it's taken just to get these turrets down, just to get remotely close to blowing open the robot factory door. <clears throat> they got the link gun on the tank. They want to be able to use the tank to destroy the blast door. Destroyed. And that is the blast door gone. And here we are into the base. Got to, oh, they've got two or three coming up here. They have, I believe it's a destroy objective. They've got to go all the way deep into this base. The next objective for them is over here. All the way over here. And I'm sorry, it's a destroy objective.
Here comes the link gun. That's already done. Just those three or four bullets has done a solid third of the damage onto the uh, shield generator. I believe it's a shield generator. They're trying to use the link up. You can see three or four of them linked up. That's so much damage. Triple rocket. It's done very well. Data cables are cut. Sentinels have been activated to wipe out the defenders that stayed around too long, and now they have these shield components that have to be destroyed. These are the shield components that hold this thing up, this wall up. All three of them. The one on the back side is particularly difficult because of the grate in front. That might be why they want to go for it first. After they complete that objective, by the way, they will have one more, and that is to come down here and destroy this AI generator. This this uh, core. And that is uh, that is the last objective. So 7 minute 5. They're doing well here. They've got good damage. They've got one on the right about half. Just, just below. Actually, almost gone Shield now. There it destroyed. is. Shield generator is destroyed. You need to get the one on the back side. One on the front side will be easy. Rockets coming flying in. That's going to go down. Shield component destroyed. And they just have the one on the back side that is literally just a scratch. They can get even a flak ball. Even a flak ball towards the back end side. They'll be able to complete this objective. They just got to get something. They're, you can see they're trying to fire the, the flak and hope that one deflects either off the ledge here or off the backside and onto the shield generator. Because you can see that it's just very hard to get that going. Nicer's on a killing spree as well in the defense. Remember Team Dan, winners of the opening map. We'll need to win this map to win the series. Otherwise we go to a decider. Division 1, which is a best of five, is coming up at noon, Eastern Time, 6 p.m. Central European Time, and then that's followed at 2 p.m. Eastern Time, 8 p.m. Central European Time with back-to-back -back best of threes uh, in Division 2. Final objective. It is an absolute spray down of link guns. Offense has been stopped in its tracks. They've got to destroy this, this AI core. <clears throat> you can see they're just ignoring, ignoring the uh, defenders, just trying to go for damage on the core. Five minute five left. Almost, he almost fell down into the into the into the crevice. That would have been instant death. Rockets coming in. It's got a lot of health. This core. Oh, shock core is eliminating the offense. They've got half of it gone though. Half the core gone. See, they're going for the fight on this ramp here, trying to prevent the attackers from getting forward. All four linked up, though. This could be the push. This very well could be the push. And it is good. Oh, it's just stopped. It's got literally a scratch left. Breathe on it, and it will fall. The defense has to hold sturdy here. Four minute 10 left. They've got to buy themselves enough time. I don't think they will. It should be all over. It is going to be all over. AI generator generators destroyed. Attacked. And it will be 10 minute 57 that Team Nice are going to get to complete these objectives. New assault starts in 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. And we are back underway with the offense of Team Wise. Or Team Nice, I should say. Instantly, the first gun taken out on the right-hand side. Three minute 51 ahead of the pace. 
Oh, they've got both down instantly. Oh, my word. The tanks are coming out in here trying to do the damage. Nice to win inside two minutes. Yeah. <coughs> well, they've got three turrets down. Team, Ni Team Nice have absolutely blitzed the turrets that were giving the problems to Team Dan. Dan himself is now in this backside turret, which is double linked. Oh, my God. They've got three link guns on it, by the way. All three link guns are linked up. This is going to be insanely hard for them destroyed. to get uh, get these turrets down. Hello, Hulu. This tank trying to do the damage. They're trying to hold. They've gotten about a quarter, a third of the hold objective. But all three link guns, all three link turrets, are hooked up. That's going to cause massive damage. Oh, God. They've even linked into, into the forward man so he can try to stop these tanks. They've just got to get someone on the objective, honestly. Even if they only are on it for a second or two, they'll do a lot of progress. But that turret Vehicle is just destroyed. so... So damaging. Dan's on a killing spree in that turret. And you can see the other thing is, as they're linked up, those turrets will heal. The link gun will heal those turrets. Again, trying to do the damage. Gun's done well. They've got one on the on the tank to do the minigun. Here, they got actually both of them. All four uh, of the off offensive players are in the tank. I think I think that's what you do. I think you you come in here with the uh, shield gun. A little bit more progress is made, but it's only a minute 13 ahead of the pace. They can't get these turrets down. I don't think you can go for them. I think you've got to get into a position where you just four players shield gun up. And get into this hold objective and just try to get some amount of time off this objective. They've got to do so. They've got one player in nice who's going to wait for his team. They've got another player who's going to wait. They've got to get these. They've got to get in there on foot. I think that's, that's what they have to do. He's going for it. He's going to hold it a little bit. He's got it down below half, but now the time is running down. Time is ticking away. I just think with how quick the turrets are going to heal, you can't afford Vehicle to put destroyed. both tanks Vehicle over here at the same time. I just don't think it's worth it. Oh, it's almost gone. Dan's on a rampage now. Ten in a row without dying. <clears throat> And they just need to get on the objective. They just need to get on the objective. They need to move forward. There it is. Can he hold it? No. They they he's putting grenades around so that they can be detonated whenever someone gets on the objective. Those grenades will disappear with his death though. And now Team Nice are behind the pace. 27 seconds off the pace now, Team da Team Nice. need to no need for this you just got to get somebody on the objective vehicle destroyed vehicles vehicle destroyed. destroyed so is that one nice completes the objective alive. though they're, these turrets are still going to be linked up but they're going to spawn it's 57 seconds ahead of the pace this is huge if they can get that turret down 
It will break the link between the turrets. That'll make it a lot easier for them. They do. The link between the turrets is gone. <laughs> Look at that bravery trying to come in and defend this turret. Dan's dominating. That turret goes 27 seconds out of the pace. They've got two turrets down. They've got the ion ca cannon in the far distance. They're trying to take down. How much health does the ion cannon have? It's down below health, half now. They've got one turret there to worry about. They've got the blast door Five as well. They need to warning. worry about. Five minute warning. Dan's dominating spree is over. Ion cannon destroyed. Ion cannon goes. They've got one turret on the far side, the plasma turret. They've got a tank on barely any health, by the way. Vehicle plasma destroyed. turret. They're trying to repair it on the far side to here. You can see they got that link going, and actually they're probably about to double link up. There he is. Vehicle destroyed. They've got a double link going for this turret. Oh no, a triple link going. <clears throat> Vehicle destroyed. That's problematic. They're pouring ammo into it, but it's being repaired. Well, the link's been broken. They get the turret. They're 40 seconds behind the pace, though. So all the turrets are down. They can go for the blast door now, but they're so far back behind the pace. It's going to take them 10, 15 seconds just to get over here towards this blast door. And they've got to try and keep this tank up for the blast door. It's going to fall. And they've got a secondary tank, but it's so far in the distance. It could get these kills, but they'll respawn before and now he's isolated he's got no help that tank's gonna Vehicle get destroyed, destroyed. I can't get anywhere near the blast door minute 25 behind the pace three minute 25 left in the round team Dan are three minutes away <clears throat> from winning this series Destroyed. Oh, they didn't even get a shell down on the on the door. They got one lightning bolt shot. Now they've got another tank coming in. Vehicle destroyed. Team Dan. Two one losers to Team YK. They have one point. Looking for more. Oh, I've just been told that the uh, Division One series has been pushed back a Vehicle half hour to twelve thirty. So, so we're ninety minutes away from that. Here comes the offense, though, pouring it on the door, link gun and everything. They've got to get it open. Uh, that should destroyed. do it, even with the vehicle destroyed. destroyed. Minute twenty-nine behind the pace. They have two minutes seventeen to get these objectives. They've got to start with the data cables. Oh, he's got double damage here. He's that that gun is purple. That's double damage. He's about to wreck havoc with this minigun potentially, or rocket remain. launcher. That's big. Double damage on Dan. That noise is the double damage fading off. Two minute five left. Or I should say two minute nine behind the pace. It's a minute 37 left. Wise is trying to avoid the shock balls. He walks right into one. They can't get any further progress. Data cables are not looking like they're going to be cut. Shield gun dodging. And there's a shot in the back with the lightning gun. Dan's on another killing spree. It's just shield gun dodge just to push the line back. Just to push this line a little further back. One minute so I think that's Natsu going down there. So you can see the shield gun just push the offend the defensive team back as they try to deal with player most likely to get towards the objective that right now is nice 
who's got in this line, and he's done damage to the data cables. Here come the rockets. Data, data cables are cut. There's still two minute 19 behind the pace. There's only 35 seconds. 30 seconds left. <clears throat> Rockets coming, firing in 23 seconds. I don't think it's going to be that. Team Dan are going to pick up three big points here. They're going to go on to four points with seven Ten, games to play. Actually, this will give them with eight, a default win, by the seven, way, because Yasu six, five, has forfeited four, out of the tournament. This is going to give them seven points. Two, one, they're going to be very. They're going to be in contention defending. for the playoffs. They're going to have seven games to go. Team Dan are two one winner or two nil winners over Team Nice. Team Nice now, by the way. They lost to Team X one to two. They beat Team Cold 2 0. So they're still on and with the default win uh, over Yasso, they are going to be on seven points, sitting at two, or I should say three and one. So uh or I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry, they're sitting on uh, two and two now, but with one point from the decider loss. So, uh, Team Nice still very much in contention themselves. 30 seconds left. That is uh, it for an hour and a half. We got an hour and a half before the next match. So we are going to uh, come, we're gonna stop the stream and then we're gonna come back in about an hour's time for division one which should be good a best of five between team not and team mind and uh, uh that is it so thank you so much for watching we'll be back in 90 minutes time with more until then take care